Today's fast-paced business environment requires IT solutions that keep you ahead of the game without fail. The passionate people at VIFX have advised on and implemented some of New Zealand's most important technology infrastructure since 2007 covering the rapidly evolving world of cloud computing, digital transformation and IT service delivery, VIFX provides strategy, architecture and build capability, as well as ongoing management across all your IT requirements. At VIFX, we're passionate about the change that's going on in the industry at the moment. Companies like Uber, like Netflix, like Amazon, are showing a way of using technology that's quite different, and it's built around the idea of the cloud. VIFX exists to help our enterprise customers bring those benefits into their own technology. The idea of agility has become really important if New Zealand businesses want to compete on the world stage. And one of the big things about the cloud computing idea is that it brings agility. Our team are fantastic and they are experts in their field. And whenever we get involved in a project, we bring a depth of expertise that customers find refreshing and quite rare. Most of the projects that we're involved in with our customers are critical. When we're involved in a project, we focus really hard on making sure that we meet the milestones and the deadlines and the requirements of the project. That means that customers trust us to be involved in those systems and especially changing those systems. The trust is built on a simple fact. VIFX does what it says it will do. At VIFX, we bring the cloud concepts deep inside our enterprise customers. So big, big organizations who have never been agile can suddenly begin to get agile. VIFX, trusted expertise, outstanding results. The frog's been throwing down windmill jams on the humans. Superior species, my butt. See, the frog's got unlimited game, so I have tons of airtime to tear up the rims. We'll chalk up the ladies. Yeah, baby, I'll shout at you later. Now, if you'll excuse me, school is back in session. New Frog Wireless. Unlimited talk, unlimited game. For just 30 bucks with no contract or credit check. In your face. Frog. Available at Intellos. The ITV smash it Pop Stars is now out on video. The Hits. The Misses. Plus new and exclusive interviews not shown on TV. Shut up. Shut up. It's 100% official. Pop Stars, the must-have, must-see video out now. If you witness an opioid overdose, don't turn away. Stay and call 911 or your local emergency number. Follow their instructions and administer naloxone if you have it. Even if you've taken drugs or have some on you, the Good Samaritan Law can protect you. It's important to stay until help arrives. The Government of Canada is taking action. Together we can help save lives. A message from the Government of Canada. Win tickets to 311. Log on to CW27.com to enter.
Topic to Portsmouth, from Virginia Beach to Newport News, from Hampton to Suffolk and Chesapeake. We are CW27, your home for the CW. Or you soon hope to. But HDTV comes with hefty digital cable bills. Well, it turns out you can get HDTV without paying for cable. Nancy Wood explains. The lonely rabbit ears, practically code for obsolete, except, as it turns out, when it comes to digital TV. If you're in the immediate vicinity of the transmitter sites, uh, rabbit ears are probably going to give you enough signal to, uh, to receive the TV perfectly. This is actually what our digital television signal look like. Guy Bouchard is one of CBC's technical experts and in his lab he can duplicate the conditions in our homes. It's going to be as good or probably better than the signal you're getting of most satellite distributor or cable caster. Want to boost that HD signal even more? Put an antenna like this one on the roof. But it depends on where you live. Here on the rooftop of the CBC, a high-definition digital signal is sent out through the air. Which means we're limited to what we're calling the radio horizon, which means it's what we can see. Alexandre Cossette has always loved to tinker. Well, now you can build your own high-def TV antenna. From and using thing. information from online forums, built his own antenna for about $30. People think they need to subscribe to an expensive cable service, Cossette says. It's just not true. Any TV can take in a digital signal. The new models have a built-in tuner. The old ones need a digital converter box. At this East End Montreal electronics store, they've seen sales of antennas soar. It's a different market, but it's a market that that, that will grow in the future because instead of having to pay something month after month, that will be something free for uh, all life long. Free? All life long? Could there be anything more perfect? Well, before you climb up onto your roof, remember you'll be saying goodbye to the 500 channel universe, bye to News World and the sports channels. If you want to keep watching them, you'll have to pay. Nancy Wood, CBC News, Montreal. Ancien signaux analogiques. Ce que ça veut dire, c'est que les bonnes vieilles oreilles de lapin fonctionnent toujours sur les nouveaux téléviseurs. En fait, c'est très simple à installer. Pas besoin d'être un castor bricoleur. Il y a une entrée pour le câble et une autre pour l'antenne. Dans la région de Montréal, on peut capter Radio-Canada. On peut aussi voir la programmation de CBC et Télé-Québec. Et enfin, il y a aussi Télévision 4 saisons. C'est au 23e. Le tuyau que vous voyez là ou en haut, c'est notre antenne à Et la couverture est bonne avec cette petite antenne? Écoutez, l'horizon radio ici est d'environ 70 km. Mais les oreilles de lapin ont de la compétition. Ceci. Avec cette grosse antenne, on peut capter davantage de signaux, entre autres ceux des États-Unis. C'est quand même incroyable. On peut capter CBS, NBC, Fox, PBS. Et c'est tout à fait gratuit. Plus les gens vont être à Montréal ou sur la rive sud de Montréal, plus il sera facile de recevoir les émissions, autant du côté américain que les émissions provenant de Montréal.